disapprove of these protests. These I've just been reviewing the test results we received on you last week. Should I start rolling up my sleeves? Surprisingly, no. I see no trace of glial tissue buildup in any of your charts. It's been six months, Doug. Shouldn't I be under opposing shots by now? One would think, but these test results show no signs of implant rejection. If anything, the bond between tissue and electrodes seems to be getting stronger. So I'm free to go? Well... Mr. Seraph did ask me to discuss another topic with you. You are aware that several precautionary measures had to be put into place during your first surgery? Not all of my implants were switched on, I know. The damage caused by the hematoma had to be taken into account. Your brain needed time to recover, to get used to the mechanical neural processors and turn them on naturally over time. Cut to the chase, Doc. What does Seraph want? He feels that you might be ready to speed up the activation process using special software known as Praxis Kits. You mean I don't have to wait for my augmentations to kick in naturally anymore? You can, if you prefer. But Mr. Seraph did make a generous donation to Lim in your name, thus ensuring that Praxis software linked to your particular neuro enhancements would always be available to you and you alone. Please. Take a look. Dr. LeBlanc, code blue. Dr. LeBlanc, code blue. Very well, Mr. Jensen. Use it in good health. Protesting is not against the law. I know that. Adam, are you finished at the clinic? For now. Good. Right now I want to know who that corpse is. Head over to the police station and get his neural hub. And Adam, if you can't talk your way in, consider making a strategic retreat. There's got to be another entrance in the side of the building. Access granted.
You don't want to get no closer, Og. It's too late to run!
spread. About time. You the home sec guy I was ordered to wait for? Tell Manderly I didn't get the memo until I was halfway through the autopsy. By then, it was too late to close him up again. Right. So you recovered the neural hub? Tricky bit of work that was. A few inches lower and the bolt would have fried more than just the pedal connectors. As it is, I can't guarantee you'll get anything useful out of it, other than the fact that it's been modified. Modified? With what? Some kind of wet drive. But hey, I didn't look. Ultraviolet means ultraviolet, and I know how touchy you guys get when it comes to matters of national security. He's all yours. The hub's been detached, but I left it in the skull, as ordered. Now, if you'll excuse me, I got paperwork to fix. Boss, I got the neural hub. Looks like it's been modified with some kind of wet drive. Pritchard should have a look at it. No, don't bring it here. Frank's not finished running his diagnostic, and I don't want to risk connecting any tech to our networks till he's done. Especially if the tech is military. So what do you want me to do? Take the hub to your apartment. I'll have Frank contact you there. Access grant. Come to gloat, Hanser. Enjoy it while you can. I won't be here long. That's pretty optimistic talk from a guy facing terrorism charges. Ain't gonna be any charges. You think your boss is the only powerful man in this city? The way I figure it, DA's getting a phone call right about now. Yeah? Well, I know the DA. He can't be bought. Ain't about money, Cholo. You and your company, you're fucking with nature. Trying to control human evolution. But you got no clue what the real cost of your tinkering will be. Thank God a lot of other men do. Powerful men. Powerful enough to pick up a phone and get me free. Just watch. Are we talking about your brother? You stay away from him, Hanser. You even think about going after him. Oh, fuck it, man. You don't know nothing about my brother and me. This ain't no zoo, you jerk. Besides, if it was, you'd be the freak everyone would come to see. Uh, I'll, I'll cover see you. you. This isn't happening, Sam.
Access granted. Come on, buddy! Got it on! No use reporting it. 
I heard that. I'm on it. Come out. Regardless, several... It's no use running. Uh.
Jensen. I very much like to meet Hands where I can see it, Jensen. To offer my deepest sympathies and assure him that these attacks Come on are up. no way linked to humanity's problem. My people have worked tirelessly to find a peaceful solution to this dispute, and I unequivocally deplore the methods used by these hostile threats. Now, that being said, I do hope the UN Come takes on. a concentrated oh, look at what happened here tonight. Mr. Taggart went on to express his sincere desire to stand in front of the General Assembly with Davis Sarah, united in their cause to find a common ground. Could that day ever come to pass? Anyone have a visual? The man whose innovations first propelled augmentation technology to the forefront will also be present. So far, Mr. Darrow has refused our repeated requests for an interview. You still out there? This is Eliza Cassand. Better look around. Back again to Detroit, where a handful of people were taken into custody this evening, following yet another anti-augmentation demonstration. This time, patients attempting to access the Second Avenue Limb Clinic found their route blocked. All the media speculation surrounding that hostage situation in Detroit has just Please. blown through the roof, Don't kill thanks to the arrival of William Taggart. Celebrity author and founder of the anti-augmentation organization, Humanity Front. Speaking from the tarmac at Wayne County Airport, Taggart called the attack... An extremely regrettable affair. I'd very much like to meet the dating Sarah in person. Now it's not a good time. Come back later. You got what you wanted. Nothing. Get out of my face. You pulling my leg or something? Offer my deepest sympathy. Jensen, I have a message for you. 
from one of your former colleagues, a detective Alexander. Jenny, what did she want? She said she could use some help if you can make your way over to Grand River Road. And might I just add, as wonderful as it is to have you back at the office, I am not your personal dating service.